Hi, this is a short video to show you how to connect up your Sky Mini Box using the Ethernet connection. Now, um, Sky has recommended that it connects up via Wi Fi, and that's actually a very good way to connect up the boxes because it, has, it actually builds um, a mesh system between themselves and they communicate quite effectively. Now, if you feel that you need to connect up hardware for any reason, whatsoever I'll show you how to do this so here it is um, I'm at my uh, bedroom mini box and it's actually connected at the back by Ethernet at the moment if you look at the back here there's an Ethernet port it may have a cover on it so if you want to just take that off but don't plug it in or anything yet I'm just showing you how it is connected on mine so I can just basically disconnect this and it will look like this okay now, if it is connected by Wi-Fi already, what you want to do, as you see, I've just taken the Ethernet off and um, it's disconnected. So what you want to do is go to your network connection. Okay, so let's do this step by step. Sorry, I'm just flicking through. So what you're going to do is press the home button, go down to where it says settings. Okay, and if you go to the right here, right again. Go to network connection. At the moment, it's probably uh, broadcasting to my Wi-Fi connection, so it, it, it um, changed to the Wi-Fi. So just press reset on that. Give it a few seconds, and it will reset. Okay, so the box is quite clever, right? So it's actually checking to see if the Wi-Fi connection is quite good. So it won't just reset. It's actually letting you know that your setup is quite good. Are you sure you want to do this? So what you want to do is go to confirm and it will take a few seconds for it to reset. Okay, so once that's done, it will come up to a screen like this. Now, don't press the middle button. Don't do anything at the moment. Just press the home button. And what you want to do is just go down to where it says settings. All right. Now, don't press any other button left or right apart from now. You want to press zero zero one and then the middle button select now what we want to check here is if there's anything to say ethernet on or off now these boxes i think now they come programmed with ethernet already on so that's fine so just dismiss that just press the home button right so don't do anything on it at the moment right remember the ethernet cable is still out it's still here so don't plug it in or anything like that now what you want to do is walk over to the nearest piece of Sky equipment. So in my case it's my main box. You can do it on any other Sky box or another mini box that is closer or the actual router, Sky router, not a third party router, right? So you see over here, there's a button here, okay? Now you want to do this quite quick. So what you want to do, see over here there's a button, it's got two arrows on it, right? Press and hold that. And then you see it goes orange, it'll flicker orange. Now run over to the box that you're going to connect. Now this is the box I want to connect, so at the moment it's doing nothing, right? So press and hold that button until it flashes, yeah? So it's flashing at the moment. Now within two or three seconds, just plug the ethernet in. Okay, so the ethernet's in, just make sure it clicks in. And just give it uh, maybe a minute or so and it will connect. So see now it's gone green, right? So what's happening is is that it's actually finding that Ethernet connection. It's WPSing over the air, but because we've put the Ethernet in, it's picking that up. Um, but I don't know why, but for for some reason, if you put the Ethernet in first, the this box will pick up the IP address some other way and it won't connect to your main box. So it'll pick up an Ethernet connection, but it won't connect. Um, so yeah, you see at the moment, it's just connected to my skybox. So yeah, give that a few minutes or so and let it do its thing. Let the green light stay on. The, what the green light staying on means is that it's still handshaking. It's finding up the pairings between the boxes and it's building up that little bubble so that all the boxes communicate with each other. It's quite easy to do. So remember, Ethernet, make sure it's not in in the beginning. So when you reset everything on just on this box, uh, the mini box that you're connecting, uh, just make you reset the network settings and um, yeah so just go over to your main box press WPS on it and then come over to this box press WPS on this box while it's flashing maybe two or three seconds later put the Ethernet cable in let it do its pairing up
any other questions please feel free to comment on below and i'll uh, see if i can help you thanks